Hello guys, in this video I am going to talk about a very specific output of the fish materialize. So that is like when you do fish materialize, uh, sometimes you get uh, like 100% line and it shows like uh, how many uh, records are went to the online feature store. But sometimes we get a, this very specific output. So whether this is a bug or this is expected behavior, so let's discuss that. So let's understand why we get uh, this uh, uh, line as the output, okay? So uh, this is not a bug basically, this is the expected behavior. So when we uh, run fished materialize incremental, okay? So there are two ways we do fished materialize. One is like direct store dot materialize. So it will uh, load features from starting like end date to start date in those uh, time frame okay and then if you do materialize incremental so again in materialize incremental there are two ways so if you are running materialize incremental the first time so it will load uh, all the records into the online uh, data store which are uh, in between ttl minus now so what is ttl so ttl you define in your feature dev.py that is a time to live so in terms of seconds into one means one day equivalent second into two means two days equivalent seconds Okay, so that you define. So if you are running uh, materialize incremental first time, then TTL minus now. So those time frame data it will load in online store. Second time, if you run uh, again the materialize incremental, then it will try to load uh, the data uh, starting from last time when you ran materialize incremental till now. Okay. So now why we are getting this uh, uh, as the output? So we get this as the output when uh, there is no new record added in your uh, original data set since the last materialized incremental run. Okay. So if I now uh, add the new record in my data set and again run this, then it will run perfectly fine. Okay. So for that, uh, let me quickly show you like how my data set looks like. So I'm using the diabetes data set. I have already converted into parquet file and kept inside the uh, fish repo data directory. Okay. Uh, so that uh, we can load it from there. So basically I'm assuming because you're running fish materialized, you know, all those steps like uh, why we do fish apply and how to prepare data set, everything. If you're new you don't know then i have created a detailed one hour video explaining each step um, one by one okay using python so that you can go through the link i am giving in the description section okay so this is the data set and coming back here so uh, here we have id is still 768 so i will add a new record with uh, id as 769 okay so let me create a new record for that and then i will run this step again okay so for that i need the timestamp so i will create a new timestamp like that and all other uh, columns value I will update and see here patient ID I'm writing 769 till 768 already there and then I will append that row into the original data set I'm appending and then here you see like 769 is created but I need to update that uh, data set original data set right so I will just write back to that data set this I written back and then just to verify if that data that new record is successfully added to original data set or not then I am reading that uh, parquet file using pandas data frame and running uh, tail, okay, panda, pd.tail. So like 769. So this record is added now. So now if you go back and again run this fish materialize, then uh, expectation is like you should not get this behavior. This because you have already added one new record in your original data set um, since this, uh, uh, since the last time this ran. Okay, so let me run this. See, now this, uh, that uh, uh, newly added record also uh, went to the uh, online store. Now, if I again run this, then again, you will uh, get back the same output. Like, uh, let me show you. See, again, you are getting this thing. Because now, again, uh, you don't have any new record in your data set. So for this, uh, you add the moment. Uh, every time you have new record in your data set, you need to do fish materialize. And then that record will go to the uh, online store. Okay, so that is all about uh, uh, what is this basically. So this is not an error. This is expected behavior of fish materialize. Okay, so that's it for today's video. If you like, then please don't forget to like, subscribe and share with your colleagues. So thanks for watching.